In this video, we'll be taking a look at the Multitude Delay Effect by Sine Vibes. We'll take a look at how we can use the intuitive Gate Sequence Delay Effect in combination with the four different delay lines and various different effects processors and LFO modulation. We'll also take a look at the presets that come with Multitude, demonstrating its abilities not only delay effect, but also sequencing and effects of all kinds. So we have an instance of Multitude placed on this vocal sample here. Our top line is our input. So we have our input level and our dry signal and we can also turn on and off the steps for the input. Underneath this we have the four delay lines, the first of which delay A we have the steps turned on for this effect. We can turn these on and off by simply clicking on the steps or just clicking and dragging to turn off a series in one go. And on the delay itself, we have our delay time, our playback mode, forward or backwards, We have our effects routing, so we can go pre or post delay or place the effect into the feedback loop. Feedback control and pan for each independent delay line. Let's bring another delay line into this effect. And on delay B, let's change the time to quite a fast delay speed and pan it to the right. We can turn the delay volume up here. And let's look at some of the effects processes that we have here. So I can apply a filter to this independent delay here, delay B. And we can also start modulating this cutoff frequency using one of the LFOs to those to the right. The LFOs are color coded. So it makes it easy to apply modulations to various parameters. Can change the speed of the LFO, or the wave shape, or even apply the chaos parameter to randomize the LFO. Bring in a third delay line now. Look at some of the other effects processes that we have here, like the frequency shifter. I can turn the other delay lines off for now. So we could apply some LFO modulation to the frequency shifter here. Use a second LFO. We also have sample rate and bit depth to apply a really crunchy effect to the sound or go all out with a circuit bender or noise. For some more experimental effects. The flanger is also very creative and applies really nice movement to the delay lines. And of course we can start modulating various parameters in one go.
take a look at our drum loop now. I've bust all the drums to one sum channel here and I have an instance of multitude loaded on the bus group. I turn this on. And because we have a kick drum and lots of different sounds playing in this drum group, I've actually placed the limiter after the multitude effect just to keep any stray peaks in check. Let's dive into some of the presets that come with multitude. We can hear that it's not only great as applying sequence delay effects, but applying effects of all kinds, you can really transform loops. Of course, once we load in one of these effects, we can very quickly and intuitively start editing the effect, making it more suitable for our purpose. Very quickly and very creatively, we can apply effects of all kinds using the combination of the four delay lines, the sequenced gate input, the various effects processes, modulators, and more. Multitude by Sign Vibes is available now at adsrsounds.com. <laughs> 